do you think there is a future for um, heroes? This is an interesting topic for me because um, Age or sorry, um, Age of Empires, the definitive edition, is a game that's still thriving today, and believe it or not, is getting you know tens and twenty, thirty, forty thousand people watching its competitive scene. Do you think there's a hope for? I think a remaster maybe or some sort of, you know, I think a remaster would be tough because you kind of have to remaster a game that's also esports, you know, compatible and all these other things. Well, uh, Ubisoft now owns the franchise. They bought it from 3 do when 3 do went under and they've been, they've been making new games uh, in the franchise. I, I, I think they've I stopped. Know, I think 2016 they're was the last, I think 2016 or 2017 was the last year they worked on that game or that franchise. But but a couple of years ago, they made Heroes 3 Remastered. They did, They did yes. remaster it. Yeah, they did. They, they put in all new graphics uh, into it. And uh, and then they also did uh, they did some mobile mobile games for the Chinese market. Yes. Uh, because, yeah. the, uh, what's his name? He, he went to work for the Chinese company, right? I uh, forgot the name. Ten- Tenet? Or, no, I can't remember. Uh, uh, John- Tencent? Yes, yes, Tencent, right? J- John went to work for them, or no? He might. I, I know he worked for one of them. I, f- I forgot which one. It could have been Tencent. Uh, it's just a quick uh, search here. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. He went to work for them. That makes sense. Uh, there was there was a few other things. Sorry, too. We're a little bit over. I apologize. Um, I'm just there's a lot I wanted to ask you. So um, there's a few games that are kind of in the works, actually, uh, that are kind of going to be the future. Let's say Heroes, Mind Magic. There's a game called so- um, Songs of Conquest. Have you seen that? No, I haven't. If you want to give that a search, or I can share a screen. I think it's really close, if not almost identical to like, well, maybe not identical, but very similar to what the old Magic games were like. Um, it's scheduled to come out in um, 2022. Looks like the studio Coffee Stain. A turn-based strategy game inspired by 90s classics. Yes. All right. Uh, well, certainly that it, it does, I'm, I'm scrolling through it now. It certainly does look like uh, I see I see uh, graphics remind me of Heroes of My Magic Three. All right. So I'll, I'll have to be paying attention to that one. Yeah, I, I just found it about recently. All right. Now, something I should share with you is that my uh, the hero, Heroes of My Magic 3's designer, Greg Fulton, is currently developing on his own a uh, spiritual successor for Heroes of My Magic 3 um, called, uh, boy. I, I also have and this. And Stratix, my, I think it is. I have this on my notes, yeah, but I don't have the uh, name of it. Yeah, you know, it's. I keep telling him to change my name because it just it doesn't roll off the tongue. Um, but uh, here, let's see if I can. Yeah, Fanstratix. Fanstratix is yeah, what it's called. <laughs> yeah, actually, I emailed him. I was wondering if he wanted to be a guest, but he's not really. He doesn't do a lot of podcasts. But I did. I uh, just briefly have a chat with him about that. So that's pretty interesting. Yeah, I mean, he he and I talk uh, uh, now and then, and uh, and. Uh, he keeps surprised about what he's doing. Yeah, he he'd much rather have me go out and promote the game than, uh, than do it himself, which I'm, I'm more than happy to do. Uh, but in fact, love to be even greater involved with it at some point uh, uh, in the future. Um, but uh, for those who are interested, uh, they, he does have a newsletter. I'll leave available a link down for below. it. Mm-hmm. Just... Great, perfect. Uh, yeah, that. Uh, but yeah, if, if anyone knows. Uh, what are the elements that made a game like Heroes of My Magic 3 successful? Greg is the person to do it, and I, I would trust him to incorporate those into a new game. Does he actually so give you, like, like, notes, or, like, he talks to you about what he's doing, like, or is he just, like, general conversations? Oh, he, uh, I, I, I get some details. Really? Oh. I get some details, you bet. And uh, I have, uh, yeah, okay. I have details. Cool, cool. Yeah, obviously, don't, yeah, don't say anything, but. Yeah, I'm, no, I, I. That's awesome. They will be revealed at the appropriate time. <laughs> That's awesome. Greg, if he sees this, you're always welcome to be on the pod to talk about whatever product you're working on. Because I'm really excited about that. I, I did hear about that. I want to talk to you about it, but it seems like you already know quite a bit. So if you're optimistic, I'm I'm optimistic. I am optimistic. And you should be too. And anyone else who's a Heroes 3 fan should be optimistic as well. 